back. It's uh, 25 to 18 in the second set. And more convincing for FEU. And talk about some tough times. And still to be rough ahead for LaSalle. As they're playing heel and risking their unbeaten record so far. Sabi ko nga kanina, is it a case of overconfidence? A little bit too complacent? Because you have yet to experience a loss. Pero FEU is not taking any chances dito, Ana. And during that last set point, ito si Coach din mentioned that uh, kulang yung puso na pinapakita ng Lasal because they only have 10 attacks, 4 blocks, and 4 opponent errors. Meanwhile, FEU has 12 attacks, 1 block, 1 ace, and 11 opponent errors. So FEU is still keeping that very clean game overall kasi ang baba ng errors wow. nila eh, lalo na compared to Lasal. So, you know, um, it's also Lasal that's giving away yung points um, for FEU. But FEU is just taking advantage. Siyempre, hindi naman sila magpapatalo lang. Dahil binigay nyo, we'll accept it. And what's the bear game? It's not much of the adjustment as with regards to lessening their errors. They even have one more pangay in the second set. And again, it's all happening right here at Paco Arena. As we welcome you to all of the action at Dito Natay's the men's division. Kanina nakaraos naman tayo ng dalawang women's games and matches. And this time, meron pa tayo after this. As we enter set number three, NU versus Ateneo. So, punong puno ng volleyball. So we need the legit challenge. Magsasawa kayo sa That's right. Puro volleyball and we also have a game this Wednesday. True. So LaSalle getting the first point here in set number three. And this time, LaSalle once again with another point back to back to open up the third set. And in the beginning of the sets, uh -huh. very intense ito yung LaSalle, but very intense din po si Dula with that quick attack. So very, um, very intense, very maingay, their demeanor is very active. Pero parang nawawala throughout the sets. Tapos, maybe it's because of the um, committed errors, mga unforced errors. Or it could be like the chicken and the egg. Hindi mo alam ano yung nag-cross talaga. If dahil ba tahimik kaya nag error But between... Yeah. Is the shiny. <laughs> yes, whenever he has the chance. Lumilipad high flyer din tong si Between for FEU. Ay, pagkatingitignan mo naman talaga yung Between, tumitingala ka nga, eh, di ba? <laughs> <laughs> Two even here in set number three. And let's see something he needs to be... Is making sure that his team is uplifted. So, okay. if you don't want to make question, Rito, I do believe we've heard from the venue announcer there's a point penalized against LaSalle. To FEU. Okay, so. The official score is 2 The all official score is 2 all. That is the. To all. So they made it official. FEU will get the point here. Alright, the. Although Coach Ed still has his confessions. Oh. But the play has. Yeah. They have decided to continue the play. And yeah. now we're at 3 2. We have Captain J. Lord serving for FEU. That's right. We have to turn our focus on what's happening on the court right here. 
Asawi get the point, they're tying it all up at three. Remember, it's FEU leading two to nothing. There's Coach Ed. Sale has a point that he wants to be uh, heard. The coaches will battle <laughs> privately on the side while the athletes uh, here will continue the game. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> so, sorry. <laughs> All right, the game is back in motion with That's Bula right. serving for FEU at 4-3. Solitary block right there, Lirik Mendoza for FEU. See, so simple, he just smiles and cheers. Kahit na single oh. block yung <laughs> ginawa. Frustrating that effort, the Lasalle. Silent killer. I know. Well, Lasalle has got to do something about this. Oh! <laughs> Between had something to do about that. I'm there with Reed. Look at him. As that set went cross court, he responded very well. He's happy with it. the result. And it's now just like that 6 3 lead for FEU. Wow! Now go on paraan, it don't gala. Eto kayang go on yun paraan. Yun naman is sabin lasan. That Gloria right there. We have Layug serving for Lasalle at 4 6. Almost right there for FPU. Good recovery here. Teto na naman yung atake ni Drix Avedra going cross court. Helpless ang Lasal every time he does that. He's just looming on the side, waiting for his turn. Todo bigay every time he gets that ball. Make sure that it's gonna be converted into a point. Another single wow. block for Lyric Mendoza. Imagine that. FEU leads us to this first technical timeout here. It's Alam nyo ba na itong si Coach Joe Roque ay pinasok din ang corporate world bago tuluyang mag full time sa pagiging coach. He used to be a data communications engineer. Naging assistant manager din siya sa isang kilalang school that specializes in computer and technology. Pero talagang hinihila pa rin siya pabalik ng volleyball. Isang trivia pa about Coach Joe ay isa siya sa mga pioneers ng BIS. Benchen Anna? Oh, I see. Parang ako pala tong si Coach. <laughs> Currently working for tech and AI okay. while being a volleyball analyst because just the love for of the game. You do need, diba? Iba talaga yung hatak, yung passion burning for volleyball. Na babalik at babalik ka talaga. Si madaling iwanan, ika nga, samantala, eto namang lasal, ayaw maiwanan. Lamang na ang FPU, two sets to nothing. FPU, Lirik Mendoza is doing his thing on defense. And he can also do his thing right there, going for an attack in the middle. Nothing can distract him, very focused on the goal. Nine serving five. Aduhar with that set. And it's Fortuna 
will get the job done and get the point for LaSalle. Fortunate for LaSalle. Fortuna spiking. <laughs> Okay, may bagong karil ka rin na gustong <laughs> ano, ano, subukan. <laughs> Stand-up comedy. <laughs> that was J-Lord. J-Lord Talisay, the team captain of the FEU, bringing back a four-point lead for uh, Tamaraos here. Kitang-kita niya yung gap between the blockers oh, in front of him. So, Lyric Mendoza that time. He can do almost everything. He can do almost everything. Almost. <laughs> but he's been showing us very good. Um, you know, a very good game today. <laughs> Another one of those smart moves from Captain J Lord. Captain na J Lord pa. Crap. Ang taas na siguro ng tingin sa kanya kanya mga kampe. Leader na leader. <laughs> oh, pinakita na ba talaga tayo niya ron? He went up for it. Kung may Gloria sa Lasal <laughs> for J-Lord sa FEU. <laughs> oh, that time it went pretty well for Tuna. Off speed. Nalito si Donggalia. Kasi malakas din tong umatake si Fortuna. So they were for sure expecting Kaya, a strong attack. But he confused them. Another one for J-Lo. Laban na nato ng drop balls, bench. Exactly. <laughs> Very strategic placements. And not only that, FEU is trying to create a separation na dito. So third set natin. Still lead by four. Twelve serving eight. Uh, he tried a mill between. But Fortuna scoring it off the block. A little signs of uh, life here. But as uh, LaSalle talk about survival mode for them. What up, sir? Number set. And the momentum is now shifted to LaSalle's side. Kumbaga, dalawang beses. Walang nangyari. At nakapagmigay lang ng dalawang puntos din. Itong si Amel between. Here he is. First ball. Atake. <laughs> that was between. Finally. Yung magkasunod na sequence, medyo touch niya kasi yung yeah. lahat. So, the frustration was probably building up at napunta lahat sa palo na yun. Mm -hmm. 13-10. Now to consider the way FEU is playing, but LaSalle is trying to respond back with Eric Layu right there, going for that kill and getting that point. LaSalle is slowly creeping up to FEU. At saka gusto nilang maibalik kung bakit sila walang talo. Gusto nilang ipakita sa lahat. Simple lang eh. The, the plays, you know, just focusing on the basic defense muna. Ayan! Buhay pa ah! Combination na yun lang. At pinatay ni Drix. Yung hope nung Lasal for that sequence. Good save coming from Gloria and um, the defense at the back. Drix Saavedra. He has shown us what he can do here. And of course... 
there's still a lot left. We know if the U will get that point. It was too sharp of an angle for Fortuna. Giving that point to FEU. We're yeah. now at 15, serving 11. Oh, I am just taking a look at the number of errors for both teams. Be control na sa errors ng Lasalle. But FEU, okay, they can throw points right there. Look at this. Second technical timeout, and FEU is up five. FEU is leading two sets to nothing and leading by five here in set number three. And coming off the second technical timeout, we're going to be taking a look at Greg Saavedra, who has played solid here for FEU. It's as if those attacks, even if you try to go block, go for the dig, helpless at LaSalle. Tricks, not with all the tricks, but bricks to make it strong for FEU's battle against LaSalle here in this match. Unti-unti, kailangan may gumawa ng paraan, magalaman. With that galawan. Talaga, dami mong baon ngayon ha. Long weekend kasi, maraming rest. So, creative yung mind natin ngayon. That was a bit too strong for J Lord. The gigil. It's something that LaSalle is going to be exploiting. LGR, thank you very much. I'm the official outfitter for V League 2024. Uh oh. Actually, may specific instructions si Coach Roque do nakita ko kanina. Uh -huh. But, a uh, little bit uh, difficult lang dun sa execution of Fortuna. Si Bituin naman na nagkamali sa side ng FEU. I will give that rating two stars. <laughs> <laughs> Yung serve na yun. <laughs> Oh my God! We have one game left. We're going to be here for a long time. Because it's a long day for this day. We mean that we want you to have fun. Another one for Lyric Mendoza. And good setup coming from Benny. He's responding very well to how Benny Martinez wants it done. Parang usually nagpapalitan sila ni Ariel Cacao. Uh -oh. But now, Benny is just proving that hindi mo kailangan palitan, Coach. Kala ko, tuntuwa na si Lyric Mendoza eh. Susuguring ka na eh. Sinama na. Gusto na din niya sumama dito. <laughs> And now we have Magalaman serving for LaSalle. 15-18. LaSalle has got to come up with something here. They need a good run. Cyan dug up by LaSalle. Wow! Look at Gerald Talisayan. J Lord, rather. J Lord Talisayan. And a timeout's going to be called here by LaSalle. Against the wall. Para sa LaSalle. Survival. They need to come up with a good run. They're training by four. Parang komportable ang FEU. Yun ang ayaw mangyayari ng Lasal. Martinez to serve. Duhar with that set. Duhar again. The push. FEU is well aware of that play. Maynard tried to save it. But wow. that attack was just too fast. 
Buti na lang, hindi ako mamimili ng uh, player of the game. <laughs> Kasi lahat eh. Diba? Ang lupit dito sa FEU. I, like, I, as I mentioned, it, the level of athleticism they have is just continuing to peak. Kita mo yung hang time, very oh, fit tong mga players, very focused. Oh, wow! All out na din tong Lasal with their efforts to catch up with that six-point lead that FEU have. Louis Ventura will return for Lasal, but he needs to do more. Benny Martinez. Is it going to be a straight set victory here for FEU? Well, we can't tell yet. Because that was a service error for Benny Martinez. Sabi mo kanina, Ana, merang may konting experimento rin sa kanyang service. Mm -hmm. Itong si Martinez. But binabawi niya with all that set up for his teammates. <laughs> oh! That was Dula taking over that net defense. Lamang na lamang din siya sa height. Timeout by Croatian here for Lasal. The gulat factor that they were not able to recover from. He has a point. Si coach has a point because hindi ka naman talaga magugulat if you're where you're Tamay, supposed to be. Diba? So it means that somebody is not fulfilling their roles properly. So yung service error na yan ba ang kailangan ng Lasal to pick up the pace and catch up with that five-point lead. Well, FPU for two sets. Previous, yun, ang pinakainabangan nila eh. That's why they were able to come up with that lead in this match. Aguha. Sumabit sabit na si Gloria Sanet. That set was too tight for him to find a, a loophole with the blocking. And you also have si Mendoza in front blocking too. Paisa. So it's really a problem. That was Rui. He has been pretty quiet during this match. Patisha na nadala, parang naging hawa-hawa na rin eh. For LaSalle, when they could not get their uh, system going. Parang virus yan, nakakahawa oh, yun. Ah, okay, Pag no? nananahimik yung isa mong teammate. How about this combination right here? And Rick Saavedra will take us to six match points here in set number three. It's now match point for FEU. In three sets. Unbelievable, no? They expect natin dito mahaba ito eh. And FEU coming in. And everything going their way. And look at that! Benny Martinez will get that one point. As FEU will win over LaSalle and dealing them their first loss in just three sets. Imagine that. And so he put an end to that. Because <laughs> ang ganda din ng distribution niya during this match uh -huh. that um, allowed this look at the score. We have 25-18 for the second and third set and 25-21 during the first. So 